Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, GamerProX here, and guys, welcome back to Among the Kingdoms. This is episode 13, and guys, in the last episode, we went out on our first adventure, and we did a ton. We went and found a desert, we explored a desert temple, explored like three or four shipwrecks, and then found some buried treasure. We did a lot in the last episode, and on top of that, we got two diamonds, we got a ton of emeralds, and we just, we just did good. Now, in today's episode, we're going to start things off by going over to the blacksmith shop because I have 10 levels, which means I can finally fix my diamond pickaxe. So, let's go ahead and get our diamond pickaxe out of the storage chest and go over to the anvil. Let's go ahead, throw it in, throw that in. It cost 18. Okay. Why did it change? It was 10. Oh, man. That's weird. Okay, well, I guess we're not fixing this in today's episode, but what we are going to be doing, since I can't do that, is I gotta go back to the desert, because I have to set up a portal over there, because as you guys know, in episode 11, we made the nether, the nether hub entrance, and the reason we made the entrance was so that I could, in the future, make a nether hub, and then have nether tunnels leading to portals that teleport us to places that we've placed portals in but there's one problem in the last episode i meant to do that in the last episode place a portal and get the cords set in this episode we could link that portal but no i forgot the obsidian remembered the igniter or the flint and steel but i didn't remember the thing that i needed so i need to go down here grab the flint and steel and then i need to make a boat and then i need to go to that place and yeah, it, I'll, it's going to be a while. Uh, where is my flint and steel? Um, well, this is awkward. I guess I can just get some of that, and then I can get a piece of iron and make one. I thought I had one. That's weird. Okay, no big deal. Let's just make one and make a boat real quick. Thank you. Oh, yeah, in the last episode, we also got some dark oak and acacia wood, which is awesome. So I'm just, I'm just going to take this and I'm going to make two boats just in case. And I have enough food to go on the trip. So I'm going to go, I'm pretty sure we had to go this way. I marked down those coordinates. I'm going to check those real quick and make sure I'm going the right way. And then we will head off. Alrighty guys. So we need to go negative 260 and then in this direction. And then we need to go this way about 3,000 blocks. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get up to negative 260, and then I'm going to get about halfway there, and maybe we can explore a little bit along the way. But, this is a long trip. So, I'm not going to bore you, because it literally takes about 10 minutes to get there, I'd say, because we don't have an elytra, which can't wait for the Ender Dragon fight. I want an elytra. But, this is the 1.15 update. The update came out, I believe, when I released episode 11. It came out the day I tried to play the game. So, that means we have bees, beehives, honey blocks, and a whole bunch of other stuff. That's exciting. I'm very excited for that because that means the honey blocks don't connect to slime blocks. So, you can make some big redstone contraptions. Like some side-by-side -side elevators and stuff. That's really cool. But, I don't want to bore you guys to death and I don't want you guys to have to see these coordinates forever so I'm gonna finish getting to where we need to go and if I find cool stuff as always I will bring you along for the adventure alrighty guys so few things um there's a a swamp biome nearby there's also a ocean monument nearby and there's a the desert biome, and I think there's a mesa biome along the way. I'm not sure, but we can lay the portals out for all of those, get their cords, and then we can start building the nether hub. Oh, this is going to be awesome. I can't wait to start building those nether tunnels because that's going to unlock a lot of stuff for us. We'll be able to do projects in other biomes. We'll be able to do a lot of resource gathering very quickly. It's just going to be awesome. And also, Lee, I want to talk to you guys a minute for a minute. Um... I think this is going to help with my commentary a lot, and it's going to help with my confidence on speaking. I am putting together a program where, well, I don't know how to word it. I'm putting together a, a um, like a public speaking thing 
for my school where I talk about um, suicide prevention. Now, I'm probably going to get red flags and stuff on this video, but I'm not going to talk about it for long. I just wanted to say I'm doing a public speaking thing where I like stand up in front of the school and like tell them why it's not a good idea and all that. And I, because I've been through it, I know what it's like to, to feel that way. I literally have been like that my whole life practically. And I kind of just want to, to uh, give people the message that they need to know that there it's, it's a permanent solution to a temporary problem in my eyes. And I want people to know that I care, that people care, that people are here to help. That's, that's what I want to do in life. And if I can do that throughout my videos and throughout school, heck, that's awesome. If I can't and I only get like one person's attention, that's fine too. Because that's one person that I've helped uh, see that they can get help and not feel ashamed. And um, yeah, I just wanted to uh, let you guys know that. I know there's, I don't, I only have eight subscribers, but I want to, I want to have that in the videos because it, it's just something people deserve to know. And uh, right here is actually a swamp biome, and that's awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place another portal, and then I'm going to go. I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna. Uh, I need to place the portal first. So I'm going to do this and this, and I'm going to place this portal. One, two, and then I'm going to get out that dirt so that I can do this. And basically what I'm doing, I'm just making the portal so that uh, I can get the coordinates, and then I'm going to light it. So right here, there's no exact center, but that's okay. Just, just stand on one block, and you're going to open up your coordinates. And you're going to take the X coordinate and the Z coordinate and write it down. And then you're going to divide those numbers both by 8. So in this case, I'm going to do 717 divided by 8 and negative 583 divided by 8. And I'm going to round it to the nearest whole number. So if it comes out like 5.9, then it's going to be 6. So you just round it up. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, and then I will get right back to you. Alrighty, guys, I got the coordinates. It's going to be 70, negative 73, and it's starting to get dark, and I need to sleep or I'm going to die. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick, and then we're going to light the portal. I took a screenshot on accident. Whoops. I wanted to turn off my coordinates. There we go. Okay, so we can light this portal now, and in the nether... Wait, yeah. Wait, hang on. Alrighty, guys, I'm going to light this portal... And I'm, do, I'm going to leave it. We're not going to enter it because if we enter it, it will make its own portal in the nether. And that's not what we want. We want this portal so that we can place the new one at the coordinates that we divided these coordinates by. And in that case, it's going to be 70, negative 75. In our main nether hub portal, we're going to go to uh, those coordinates. And those coordinates should spawn us at this portal in the future. That's what I'm hoping. And I'd like to be able to make a slime farm in the future now that we've found a swamp. Because that'd be awesome. And we can also make a witch farm in the future, I think. That'd be awesome as well. And, man, there's a ton of cows. Okay, I think I'm going to slaughter some of these. Sounds sad and depressing, but we... It, it's life. Come on, get over here. Get over here. Thank you. Thank you. Did I get any leather from that? Yes, I did. On, the, on our ways, I'm going to be killing a ton of cows because I need leather. I need to start enchanting my tools. And I'm also going to grab lily pads because we can decorate our pond with lily pads. And that, that that's just, it adds a whole new uh, level of awesome to our, our world, I think, in any way. So, I'm going to keep adventuring. I'm going to find cows and kill them and take all of their leather. And when I find another biome, I'm going to hit you guys back up. I just found the mother load of leather. Thank you. I'm just going to do that real quick because we need tons of leather if we're going to enchant anything in the future. Nice. We're already up to 10. I'm going to go ahead and kill these ones real quick. So I think in the future, if I can find some llamas and get them, maybe if I take like kill a traveling merchant and take the llamas that he has, we can make a llama farm. 
and literally all that is is a leather farm. You could do that with horses as well, but I think llamas are a little less convenient, in my opinion. So, in the future, we might do that. I don't know, though. Let me know what you think on that. Because it, it's kind of a... You gotta steal the merchant's llamas. You can get them by yourself, but it's easier to just kill the traveling merchant. I don't know. I'm gonna think about that. You let me know what you think. I'm gonna keep traveling. Alrighty, I found the ocean. Let's go ahead, get our boat out, and set sail. Ooh, hello. Uh, there we go. Okay, I know how to boat. Alrighty, guys. So, I found that, um, uh, guardian temple thing, that ocean monument. I think what I'm gonna do... I'm going to go over to this patch of ice, and I'm going to build a portal on this patch of ice right here because I want to mark this place, but I also don't want to uh, build too close because then we get pwned by them every single time we get here. So. This portal, I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to grab its coordinates. It's going to be 2,200 and then three negative 342. Alrighty, and those coordinates are 275 and negative 43. Awesome. Okay, it's starting to get dark. I'm going to take a nap and I'm going to continue on with our adventure. And before I forget, let's go ahead and light that portal so that when we try to actually use it, it works. And let's go ahead and go back out to sea. So we have two portals now. That's awesome. I'm, I'm hoping that we can get our desert. I just got to find it. I marked the coordinates down. It's just going to take forever because it's about 4,000 blocks away from our spawn chunks. So I will see you when I get there. What the heck? No way. Is that a shipwreck? Above water. No way. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, we have to explore this one. This is easy access. Uh, ooh, can you stand on boats? Since when? That's kind of cool. Okay, let's go in here. Uh, what? Excuse me. Let me, let me in. Let me in. Captain's quarters. Thank you. I'll take it. I'll take it. Four emeralds. Now there should be some more below deck. If I'm not mistaken. There should be one in here. Books galore! Oh my heavens! Yes! And a buried treasure map. Maybe we can explore that in today's episode. Uh, I just, I need, I need oxygen. Oxygen is a thing. I'm a human being. I need it. Thank you. This is weird. Is this another shipwreck inside a shipwreck? This is cool. I'm intrigued. I, th th these things fascinate me. I don't know why. They just do. Oh yes, I was right. Uh, I'll take the wheat and I don't need poisonous potatoes. Ooh, Frostwalker. Ooh, we can, we can run across. We can run across the water. We could be Elsa. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Nice. Does this take up dur- It doesn't take up durability. This is cheaty. Oh, this is awesome. This is so cool. Can you? Oh, you can turn it into an ice farm. Wait. Can you make an ice farm out of this? I feel like you could, but I also feel like that'd be very cheaty. I don't know. I'm going to continue on this way. I'm going to burn through a lot of... That's another shipwreck. Hang on. I don't know if I'm getting lucky or if these things are just super common, but I'm not complaining. This is just awesome. I love this. This update was amazing. Yeah, more, more lapias. I don't need the iron nuggets. I should be taking them, but I, I don't want to at the same time because I'm lazy. So, let's go ahead. Come down here. And I think the captain's quarter is right here. Open, open, open. Ooh, a clock. Another buried treasure map. I'll take it. Uh, we can clear out some of our inventory of some of the random stuff we don't really need. And we can get out of here because I need oxygen. Thank you. Now, oh man, this would make a cool ship in a bottle. Oh, 
This is this is awesome. Okay, I need to find. I think these are the trap. Is that a trap door? Uh, somewhere there's another chest. This I guess this is a hidden chest in itself. Oh crap! Water. Found it. Eh, I'll take the. Eh, no, I won't. Projectile protection. Protection three. Okay. Time to be Elsa again. Uh. Oh crap. Uh. Whoa! 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 That was weird. Okay. Like that. And back on Walda. It's just another good episode, man. I found another one. Oh man, this is so this is awesome. I'm 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 just I'm happy. Um now I think there's a chest down here. But whether or not I can get to it, I don't know. Yes, there is. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. I This update just... It brings so much life to this video game. And I love it. Because I it's just it's weird. Because this, this game didn't have life in its oceans for a while. Okay. There is another chest. That's just... Oh, wait. Okay. Maybe I'm... I, I was lied to. Yep. Called it. Hang on. Get out of there. Is there one down here? No? Okay. Well, that's a bummer. Eh, not really. We have a ton of emeralds. So, I was looking at my inventory and I was thinking to myself, you know what would be awesome right now? If we had an ender chest. And I, th oh, I just found another ocean monument. Oh, that's cool. Uh, we don't really need that one, but I guess if we ever needed more sponges, I know where it's at. So, that's cool. And that looks like a shipwreck over there. I'm not going to explore every shipwreck that I find, but I do want the treasure maps too because they always have good loot in them. Well, most of the time. But yeah, I really, I think we're going to be making an ender chest soon just because we need one. But I'm running on water like Elsa still. And we made it. We made it. We made it. Oh my lord. That took forever. That, that took way too long. Okay, we found it. Now, I guess while since we're here, we might as well explore. I don't know if this is the same one or not. So, yeah. But if it is this if it's not the same one and we find the temple or a temple, no, this is the same one. Okay. That sucks. Well, anyways, w let's go ahead. Let's make our portal. That's why we're here. And yeah. Okay, I need a block of dirt. So that I can pillar over. Nice. Okay, let's get these cords. These cords are going to be 3,713 and negative 426. And we're going to divide that by 8. Alrighty, and those coordinates are going to be 464, negative 53. And I need to take a nap or I'm going to die. I feel like I say that a lot, but it's true. And this place, I don't want to mess with the... Um, that the the zombie, I forget what they're called, cause I, I I'm not gonna lie, I I don't normally play in survival mode. Well, I play in survival mode. I just don't play on normal mode or anything like that. But I locked the difficulty in this world, because pro gamer, actually not. Nah, that's cringy. Okay, since we're here, we might as well go ahead and gather some more resources. I might get uh, a couple more stacks of sand. Actually, I am gonna do that. Because we need sand in the future, and it'd be nice if I had it. So let's just go ahead and get it. So, in this episode, since we've done this, I'm thinking maybe we can build the portal, like the, 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 the nether hub itself. And in this episode, I'm thinking, since we're here, um, I can meet you guys back at the base, I guess, after I'm done getting these resources. And then we can start making the nether hub and actually enter that portal because we have yet to do that. But also I need to get the coordinates for that big portal that we made for the entrance way because um, the way this game works, it's kind of weird. The exact placement for the portal when you build one in the overworld, it's not always the exact location that it needs to be in the nether. 
So we need to divide the overworld coordinates for our main portal by eight and then move the portal to where it needs to be or else it won't link properly and then your hub's just confusing and it doesn't work and all that. So yeah, we need to do that. But I also really want, I, I just want the sand. So I'm going to grab this sand and then I think I'm going to meet you back at the house unless I find something else cool that distracts me, which is very possible. And um, we can, we're going to start that today i think so yeah i'll see you guys in a little bit Alrighty, you guys i'm got i got all my sand i got four stacks and now i'm on my way home all right you guys we finally made it this took it took longer to get back home than it did to get to those places which is kind of sad but there's the the portal entrance and we we've got a ton of stuff let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away real quick and i th think i didn't get enough to repair my diamond pickaxe but I do have a ton of books and I think I'm going to use two of the, uh, six of them, I think to make a new bookshelf and that, or no, I'm not actually, I'm not going to make bookshelves yet. Huh? I know. Yes, I am. I'll be right back. All right. And now that I got that situated in my head, let's go ahead and put this stuff away. Let's put the subsidian away because we don't have enough to do anything else with. I need to go over here because that's where my sugar cane is. It's over here in the farm. I guess I can go harvest this stuff as well. Ready for some satisfaction? Same here. Okay. Boom. Oops. Oh, yeah. We can freeze our pond. We oh, we have an ice skating rink now. Oh, that's cool. I don't know. I, I think everything's interesting and cool. But, yeah. We got 41 now. And I haven't seen any pillagers yet. Or raiders yet. So... I, I don't want to keep my guard low, but I haven't seen them in a while. Kind of concerned. I am going to take these boots off, though, because it's going to be annoying when I'm trying to walk around this area. Let's go over here. Let's get some of our sugar cane, like so. And then say hello to the cows. Actually, we can breed the cows as well since we're in here. Why not? We have four, so let's do it. Thank you. Make babies. Okay, now we can make our books, but we need to make our paper first. So let's do that and that. Nice. We can do that and that. And then we can put this here, get our books. Awesome. Okay, now, whoa, I didn't know you could shift click into the crafting table. That's kind of cool. Okay, we can go over here now and we can get some enchantments. So let's do that. Alrighty, let's do this thing. We got books. Let's do this. Okay. Knockback, Feather Falling 2. That's actually an okay book. I like that. We could put that on a pair of a uh, new set of armor. Loyalty, Power, Ban Athropods. Eh. Unbreaking 2. I kind of like that Unbreaking 2, but that's a level 16. Okay, that's as much as we can do right now because I don't have a lot of levels. Uh, let's go ahead and do what we were going to do, though. We are going to be working on, now that we're back from our adventure... We are going to go into the nether and we are going to start building our nether hub. And like we, we, built, we, blah, blah, blah. we built the entrance. Now we need to build the hub. And once we build the hub, then we can build the tunnels. And the tunnels are where we're going to run down and that's where we're going to get to the access portals. It's going to be interesting. But we've never loaded this portal before. So let's be careful. I, oh wait, I need to get the cords for this portal. I don't have them. Okay. Oh, that was so loud. Apparently, I did get those cords. Negative 18, positive 1. Alrighty, the reason I'm back so quickly is because we have another portal here that we need to get rid of. Like so. And then we need to delete it. Uh, well, I, I guess I can leave that portal for now. But we need now we need to go back in. And then the portal that we go to... Oh, I need my diamond pickaxe for this. Hmm... I, I'm going to have to get some XP or something. I, I might have enough. I don't know. Let's see. Alrighty, guys. I'm going to make a new diamond pickaxe. I'm also going to try something. I th It might be cheaper to just combine two pickaxes than it is to, uh, to spend the diamonds. So I might be able to get this cost down. Never mind. It went to 15. Okay. That's cool. Well, anyways, I'm going to go into the nether. I'm going to get the nether portal. As you can see, I went in there and grabbed some uh, 
of the obsidian. Oh, I got some obsidian from the base. But I need to go in there and I need to harvest some obsidian. I think what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to tear down this portal. It's going to make my life easier. I'm tearing down the old portal. I'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. Negative 18, positive 1. Those are the coordinates. Alrighty, I'm in the nether and I'm terrified. But I need to go over here so I can get away from gas and all that. Man, there's so many pigmen. Hey, guys. Okay, we need to go to negative 18, positive 1. Right here is where our portal should be. So that's like the center of our portal. So as long as one of these middle blocks is like this, this should be correct. So let's just go ahead, do this. Let me get these coordinates out of the way because that's kind of annoying. And I'm going to mine this out. Like so. One, two, three. And then one, two. Okay. Now we light this. Oh, crap. I need to get rid of that other portal. Um, hang on. I need to get rid of this portal. Real quick. Alrighty, it's broken. Uh, let's go over here and light this new portal with our flint and steel that I remembered to bring. That would have been really bad. Let's light this. We should, we should spawn in our hub portal. Yeah! Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so we spawn in our portal hub, and that means that it canceled that portal from the original spawn, or the original portal spawn, and... We should automatically go to the new portal that we made, which we do. Oh, that's awesome. And since we're, we're in this little cave area, we're kind of safe from the pigmen and stuff. Oh, this is awesome. Yeah, we're a couple blocks safe from the, uh, the gas and all that. And, oh man, I'm excited. Okay, let's go to the overworld real quick because I need to uh, pause the recording and go to my creative world because... I want to show you guys what we're going to be building. Because I don't I don't know if we're going to build it in today's episode or not. i got to see how long this episode is. So I'll see you guys in the creative test world. Well, this is different. I can actually fly and do stuff. Okay, so in here, you can see I did a lot of building and stuff. Uh, this is something I want to build in the future. This is the, the portal hub entrance thing that we made. Over here is what our nether hub is going to look like. I think that this looks awesome. We need, I think that's, I think that's regular nether brick. Yes, those are nether brick stairs. So we're going to need a ton of nether brick, which is okay. And then this is spruce wood and birch wood. This is all materials that we have already. And then this right here is the portal. I think these portals are three blocks wide in my design though. Yeah. So I'm going to have to extend that portal by one block, but that's okay. I can do that off camera. Um, and then, yeah, I'm going to gather the resources for this for the next episode. And this is going to be the project for the next episode. Because I think this episode is about 20 minutes. I haven't checked yet, but I'm about to check. Just give me a minute. Alrighty, guys, I lied. It's not 20 minutes. It's almost a half an hour. So, I'm going to end things off here before it gets any longer. If you like this video, hit the like button down below. It would be greatly appreciated. And if you're new to the channel, think about hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell icon down below so that you can get notified for whenever I upload daily videos to the channel. And guys, in the next episode, we're going to be building the Nether Hub so that we can eventually build the Nether Tunnels. And I'm very excited for that. So, I'm going to do some stuff off camera, get some resources, smelt down some glass. That's why we needed the glass from the desert. And I will see you on the next adventure. Bye-bye!